Hi everyone, welcome to Life Mastery Partners. In today's Tech Mini Bike series, we are going to learn about how to design a custom thumbnail for your YouTube video. Let's jump into the video right away. Login to canva.com. So, this is where we are going to create our thumbnail. This is the tool which we are going to use. Click on this icon to start. Select custom dimension. Enter width 1920 and height 1080 pixels. Click on create new design. Click on Uploads to upload an image from our thumbnail design. Select device as we gonna select from our local computer. You can see the upload status here. Click on the image once upload is finished. This is the image as you like. I am selecting this square to create our text in it. We can change its color to white. So this is where we can get our text styles. I have selected heading text style. I am changing its font style to Oswald. Just click and type the text. If you want to change its color, you can do so by clicking here. I am changing the color to blue. Subscribe to my channel. You can change font color here. Just keep on changing your color until you are satisfied with it. You can move the text with the shape by selecting them and use Ctrl G or select this group option from using the right click. You can simply drag and drop. Now I am tilting like this. Use Ctrl C and Ctrl V to duplicate it. As we already grouped it, it is easy for duplication. I am doing it one more time to get an another object like this. Now change its text. If the text is larger, you can resize the shape. You can ungroup it if it is needed. So I am changing the color 
You can keep changing the colors until you are satisfied with your design and look. I removed the background as it didn't sweep. Now I am uploading my own image from my computer. You can remove its background in just single click. Click on this background remover. How it is processing. See now the background has been removed. Please subscribe my channel. These are predefined filters. We can also use this. It is recommended to change image saturation, tint, and blur. I am changing the values. It's purely your choice. You can change them based on your own interest. You can position your image by just using drag and drop like this. Click here to see our design in full view. You can press escape key to go, go back to the designing area. Now I am going to use this square shape to create some design. I am changing its color and tilting a bit. Click here to change the transparency. I am just applying some filters to see how it looks. Use this line to design a border for our thumbnail to make it different from others. Resize the line to the border size. As before, use copy and paste to duplicate the object as we need 4 lines to construct the border. You can use arrow keys for micro movements like this. To get vertical line, I am just tilting it to 90 degree.
please support my channel by subscribing it. And press on the bell icon to get all the notifications once I upload new videos. Thanks for supporting. Again, you can use same Ctrl C and Ctrl V to duplicate this vertical line and move it. Changing the line color here to make it look more contrast. Now our thumbnail is ready. Now we can download it here as JPEG. I'm increasing quality to 100% to make my thumbnail high resolution. Here you can click on OK to save our thumbnail. Happy learning! Thanks for watching. Leave a comment 